Good day, everybody. I'm over at the woodyard today. It is Sunday, so I just uh, made a run to Menards. Want to add a little security here, so I bought one of these heavy duty, I think it's 3 8 cable, and some locks that are key to like and uh, have cabled the log splitter to this tote of firewood. So that should at least slow somebody down. And things are starting to dry out here, so hopefully soon I will be able to go ahead and get some things cleaned up over here. In the meantime, still have this uh, tote of wood here waiting for that gentleman who does the swaps with me. But I have one of these Toe Smarts on the pickup box trailer just to keep you from walking away. Stick with us and I'll show you the new trailer that we have for Timber Vision. So stick around. So here is the new trailer. It is an H&H &H heavy duty landscape trailer. Got uh, two and five sixteenths coupler chained to the ground for security. Ball lock for security. This came with a spare tire mount and a spare tire, which is something that every trailer should have, in my opinion. And it's 18 foot. Got these uh, heavy-duty rails on the side, not for tying down, just for keeping stuff inside the box, like firewood, etc. Got some nice steak pockets along the edge. Two 5,200-pound axles with greasable bearings from the outside, and then this was one of the keys. I was interested in heavy-duty gate slash ramp with the ladder style angles in there for extra support for loading and unloading of the tractor with its implements on it so pull a pin on each side like that spring assisted oh, you can see those from here uh, but there are two springs down here in the bottom to assist in the lifting. Basically relaxed, it's in the upright position. Then as it goes down, it puts tension on the spring. So then it gives you an assist for lifting it back up. LED lights all the way around. Some nice, uh, they're kind of set back in a channel there so they are less easy to you know break reflectors on the side and i got this from zach sales and service in sherburn minnesota so i'll give you a little view of this if you wanted to take a gander at her but basically um 5,200 pounds is what I can put up on this trailer so that the trailer is heavy obviously big steel trailer but 5,200 should give me plenty of payload capacity for what I'm going to do which would be firewood the little tractor and implements on that tractor with 18 foot so I could put additional attachments up front and still fit the tractor on there um, and possibly throw some stuff in the back um, so I figure I should have at least an extra four to six foot because the uh, tractor did fit on a 12 foot my previous trailer fit on it but 
was maxing out the axles in my opinion so just kind of want to give you an update on this new piece of equipment that has come to timber visions so you will be seeing me use this a lot i think so um thanks for stopping in and watching today until next time be safe brothers and sisters